this is Rich Osweiler coming to you from the 2012 NAMM show in Anaheim, California. I'm here with none other than Jeff Skunk Baxter at the Roland booth. And we are, yeah, and we are, we're going to talk a little bit about a, a fusion between Fender and Roland with the G5 VT Roland guitar. I like the word fusion. Excellent. Is that cool? Collaboration? Better than collaboration. No, it's all good. I love that. I like the word fusion. Right on. Well, Skunk, why don't you uh, why don't you take us through this baby and uh, let us know what's going on? Well, we'll do it real quick. It's uh, basically a Stratocaster, which is if you start out with a Stratocaster, you're not doing so bad with all the sounds. But the thing that this thing does, it does two things. Very interesting. One, it switches tunings. So. Which to me, if you like I said before, if you've ever tried to do a drop key toning live, it, yeah, it's a horror show, right? Open G. And um, this I love. A little baritone action. And of course, all the tones are available. And a Barrico guitar with a tremolo bar. It's kind of scary. Right on. How many tuning options are there? Uh, well, let's see. There's, I mean, I count them on here. There's a drop D, there's a G, there's a D. And then there's the baritone, which I just love. And then there's a, uh, there's another a D tuning with a, with a, uh, Minor seven in the top. So um, there's probably six different tunings. Then this thing gets into some, besides having all these other sounds to it, like, uh, I mean, that's a strat. That's the strat that lives inside the guitar. Gotcha. It's amazing. Yeah. Telly. You know, if you're if you're a telly, the reason I'm looking down here is so I can see what I'm doing. Good telly. And then there's always a time when you want to do the heavy metal stuff. I used to say, you know, when I was in my college dorm with a Dremel tool, putting other pickups in people's guitars, you know, putting humbuckers and Stratocasters, but Stratocasters don't have to do that. This thing is amazing. And then there's this, then it gets really nuts. Acoustic. Now live, if I, if I could just go to that in the second verse. All on the fly. Walk around, I mean, how cool is that? And right now I have it on the drop D. So the tunings operate along with the different um, uh, uh, guitar, um, I, I guess, um, types, if you want to call it. Which, then there's some really, then it gets fun. <laughs> no way. I know, it, 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 it makes me smile. I don't know what to tell you. And then this. Super 400. Are you kidding me? That is a mess it's, of fine tones. It just blows me away, and then this kills me too. To have an acoustic 12 string guitar with a tremolo arm. Switch over to electric. Pretty stunning. It's beyond. It, I, I don't know what to tell you. Wow. Well, Skunk, thank you so much for your time. You're so welcome. Um, I'm sure they can find it on their own, but tell us where uh, where our folks can uh, find out a little bit more about this baby. Manana, which would make tomorrow, for, uh, Thursday the 19th, 19th <laughs> for all you uh, date freaks out there. Yeah, they'll, they'll have it online and. 
I, I don't get impressed much anymore. I'm too old for that crap. This impresses the, the hell out of me. Well, thanks again, Skunk. Appreciate your time. You're more than welcome. This is Rich Osweiler coming to you from the 2012 NAMM show for PremierGuitar.com.